When we resist the demolition crew, that's when we struggle to have faith in the universe. I'm really struggling to keep my faith in the universe. I feel like I'm doing all the things, but everything is falling apart. My business is struggling. My relationship is struggling. And I feel like I don't even know who I am. Any advice or guidance would be helpful. I get really excited when I read questions like this and not because I'm some weird sadistic person (laughs) where I like to see people struggle. That's not it at all. I just know thinking like a scientist (laughs) based on all the patterns that I've experienced in my life that I've watched my students go through, that I've watched my friends go through, that I've watched my clients go through. When we find ourselves in moments like this, it means the universe is really forcing us to let go of the how. Just completely let go of the how. Because there are desires that you may have, like for example, in your business, you may have the desire to create something that gives you financial freedom, for example. But there's so many more directions and so many more paths to financial freedom than having a business, for example, right? Or like your relationship, you might have a desire to feel a certain way with another person. It doesn't have to be that relationship or the relationship doesn't have to look in that way. There's just so much freedom in like we can have what we want And we can allow the universe to help us remove the old foundation and then help us build the new skyscraper. Because you're here in MBA because we're building skyscrapers. But before we came into MBA, we have a one-story house with a one-story house foundation. And in order for us to build a skyscraper, we need to remove the old foundation. And the universe comes in and starts building the skyscraper for us the moment we allow it to just remove the old foundation. We allow the demolition crew to come in. When we resist the demolition crew, that's when we struggle to have faith in the universe. When we resist the demolition crew, that's when we experience struggle. But struggle is just a perspective. It doesn't have to seem like a struggle. It can be, you can see it from the perspective of like, oh my God, this is so exciting. The skyscraper is being, being built right now. That's how I choose to see it. Every time she is falling apart in front of me, I'm like, wow, I can't wait to see what this turns out to. <laughs> like, I can't wait to see what this turns into. I cannot wait to see the skyscraper get built because just the old foundation wouldn't be removed if there wasn't a new foundation. Nature abhors a vacuum. Something has to come into its place and it will. And by the way, I'm not saying that like, your business is going to go away or your relationship is going to end or anything like that. It's just going to, it's getting reconstructed. It's going through a little plastic surgery. Okay. Your business is going through plastic surgery. Your relationship's going through plastic surgery. It's going to look a little different and it's going to be so much better than what you could have imagined. So that's my advice. That's my guidance is just to like, just don't put pressure on yourself to have things be different. Just be with it be in the discomfort of it and then use your tools to help you clear the discomfort as it comes up while you're in this in-between process. This sounds a lot like what Mikosi calls the void and the void is not a bad place to be. It's actually a very powerful place to be in because what comes on the other side is a total rebirth. You will not recognize yourself on the other side of this and I for that I am so excited for you. 